Hey guys, Gogs are here and welcome back to a brand new match day vlog. Today, Motherwell take on Dundee United in the Cinch Premiership. Uh, Motherwell, of course, four points behind Dundee United, uh, who are in fourth place in the league. Uh, and hopefully we can sort of narrow that gap uh, and be a bit further away from the rest of the pack that are trying to chase us. And... Yeah, we just have to do better than Saturday against Dundee. That's uh, Dundee FC, not Dundee United, because a lot of people get pissed off at people saying Dundee instead of Dundee United, and under the, understandably so. Anyway, without any further ado, before we get into the vlog, please make sure you're subscribed to the channel and like this video if you want more of this snazzy content. Anyway, enjoy. <laughs> So here we are back in Motherwell, Motherwell versus Dundee United, hopefully we can get revenge off of Dundee United and the last time we played them because uh, that did feature a wee bit of heartbreak. But, I'm quite optimistic tonight. I don't know if that's misplaced, but, you know, what usually happens, we get battered off a team that plays in the bottom six, and then we end up somehow, rolls reverse, and we go and beat someone that, that's in the top six, like the previous games uh, before Dundee on Saturday. And here we are, back at the Mecca, of course. And Trevor Carson makes his return to Far Park. Hopefully it's not a happy one. So there's not even 10 minutes till kick off. If you had a knife to my throat, I'll tell you, I think it's gonna be a one each draw. Can't really call between the two sides. So yeah, you know, really strong side this season. I'm just hoping that we put in a good performance. I'll, I'll happily take a point tonight, uh, bounce back from Saturday, but here's hoping that we can shock a few people on the way.
So, of course, it is Wednesday. It's the day after the game, and I just thought, well, I came back last night. I was hoping to get this video recorded. The intro was actually post-recorded as well. I, I've not actually left my seat. I just cut into a different clip. Uh, and, yeah, honestly, that was a much better performance, uh, especially in the first half. Motherwell were uh, dominant, to say the least, and we absolutely deserved the three points, in my opinion. Uh, it was going to be comprehensive if, if Kevin Van Veen could actually hit, hit the the target, but he, he just couldn't score. Um, but we had several chances, and Liam Kelly had nothing to do. So it was a great night all round. Uh, fantastic to see Motherwell uh, back at their best. Well, not not quite their best in the second half, but uh, I think the, the conditions took over the game uh, when it, when the game changed in, th in the second half. Dundee United came back into it when Barry Maguire was sent off, and rightfully sent off. I mean, it was a stupid uh, second yellow. He should have dived in like that, uh, and it threatened, it, it left us vulnerable on a pitch that was so unpredictable at times. Uh, so I'm just happy that we managed to pull through. Um, there are quite a lot of positives from that performance. Uh, Tony Watt, what a goal. What a performance from him as a team. We played really well as a unit. Nathan McGinley uh, was a bit questionable at the best of times. Uh, but apart from that, I am absolutely delighted with the performance and hoping that we can take that into the game against Hibs on Saturday. Hibs is a, it's a massive game. If Hibs win, then they can close the gap again and on fifth place. And they've got a couple of games in hand over us. So if we if we can at least take a draw from that, I'll happily take a draw from uh, Hibs away on Saturday. And uh, we'll see what's what. But Dundee United play Celtic. So there, there, there's a big chance. And, and of course, Hearts play Celtic on Thursday. So like everyone's playing Celtic very soon. Uh, we're playing Celtic, I think, next week as well. So th this could be a very, very big next 10 15 days or so um is some fixtures are going to be huge uh, and I'm, I'm really looking forward to it and of course uh hibs play rangers tonight i'm just hoping everyone just drops points around us and we just pick up a couple of nice uh, three pointers and that would be fantastic to take home uh but yeah anyway guys thank you very much for watching today's video please leave a like down below on the vlog if you haven't already uh subscribe if you haven't already as well and uh, i'll see you in the next one take care